Hi there, I'm Dr. Regina Zona and this is Mindset Monday. So today we're going to talk about overcoming those dreaded plateaus. Now you might not know what I'm talking about. When you have started the process of, of a new project or you're working on something technically and you know you start that process and it seems like there's just endless progress that just happens on a regular basis and you feel really, really good. And then at some point it comes to a time when everything, all that progress seems to level off, right? You don't see this sort of forward momentum. It seems no matter how many more hours you put in or how harder you work at it or how much more research you do to uh, try to figure out how to continue progressing, it seems like nothing actually works and all of the progress stops. But I want to tell you that, you know, this is part of the process, the process of growth, is that you're going to see a whole lot of momentum at the very beginning, then it levels off for a little while while all of those concepts are sort of seeping into your being. And then you start to move ahead. It's just so sort of like hiking up a mountain. Sometimes the trail levels out and progress seems to stall, but eventually it's going to start raising up again and you're going to get to the top of that mountain. So the thing is that what you have to do is just sort of, first of all, know that a plateau is going to happen. It's going to happen and you just need to embrace it for what it is and use that time to keep working, keep doing it and waiting for the perfect moment for that progress to to happen again. So I just have a couple of tips that you can utilize to help push through those plateaus. The first one is embrace patience. Okay, so that's annoying. And actually, a couple of weeks ago, I actually did a whole Mindset Monday on how to be patient in the process of uh, ma making strides in your vocal development. And so the same thing is applicable to this, is that you want to make sure that, that you really give yourself some grace to understand that progress rarely comes linearly. Okay, sometimes you make a lot of progress that goes very quickly and sometimes it levels off and you need to just sort of wait it out. So try to be as patient as you po possibly can. Then number two, diversify your practice. So if you find yourself singing the same songs or doing the same exercises day after day, even if you're thinking very conscientiously about the technique that you are trying to implement. Try to switch things up, you know, explore some different genres, some different vocal exercises, some, some singing with a new backing track or something, something that sort of like reignites that, that spark of passion, which, which will allow you to not necessarily think about this plateau that you seem to be on, but it helps help you think about moving forward. Seek guidance, right? So don't hesitate to seek advice from mentors and vocal coaches or fellow experienced singers. You know, their feedback and insights can be really, really helpful to help you sort of navigate through this plateau and then wait it out until you pass it through. Record and listen. So when you are singing something and you're really trying to implement a new technique and trying to work through something, sometimes when you're in it and you're doing it, you can't negotiate, you can't really hear what it is that is actually happening in your voice. Because remember, when you are singing, you can't actually hear 
your voice the way that the world hears you. So record yourself singing regularly and objectively listen to the playback. The thing is that this is going to allow you to hear both your strengths and the areas that need work, but the other important thing about this is that when you're going through a plateau and it seems like nothing's going right, sometimes when you actually listen to yourself singing, you realize that, oh, hey, actually, that sounds pretty good, okay? That is sort of on the right track. And then that will make you feel like little progress is being made as you're going. Find your inspiration. So reconnect with what ignited your passion for singing in the first place. So whether it's listening to your favorite singers or attending a live performance or revisiting songs that resonate with you emotionally, you know, let the magic of music fuel your fire, okay? In these plateaus, make sure that you stay positive, right? Because I know that it can be incredibly frustrating when it seems like you're working and working and working and getting nowhere, right? So you got to remember that our minds are very powerful tools that help in shaping our reality, right? So if you keep saying, oh, I can't stand this, I can't move forward, I'm not making any progress, then what happens is that starts to become a self uh, uh self-imposed reality, okay? Um, so what you want to do is you want to make sure that, that you realize that it's all part of the journey. You keep telling yourself that and you need to celebrate your achievements and how far it is that you have already come. That is worth celebrating. All right. Remember that breaking through a plateau requires a combination of patience, persistence, and a positive attitude. PPP. Oh, look at that. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> okay. So what you want to do is you want to support yourself in this journey, so celebrating every little victory and lifting yourself up in this challenging time in any way that you possibly can. Okay, so here is a quote that I leave you with that it is by J.R. Rim, and it's called, At Some Point You Will Hit a Plateau. If you keep doing the same things you did to get to that point, make a change. So it's time to change up. If you have hit a, a plateau and are frustrated, know that this is not permanent. Just shake up the apple cart a little bit and you will finally see that progress eventually. Have a great day.